this video, we will discuss finding candidates in your Crelate database. So you have both a separate section to run Boolean keyword searches up in the lower left hand corner. But if you're quickly just navigating through a contact grid, I may also want to find specific contacts, opportunities, or companies with a specific filter or characteristic. Within all three sections, you will have a find option up above on top of your screen. Selecting that will prompt a side panel over to the right hand side. From within this section, you'll receive a use of popular filters over to the right such as current position, tags, and past activity. Today we'll run a quick filter and save our results so you can see the example. For startles, we'll choose a tag option and we'll select every candidate in our database with an A ranking. I can either begin typing to receive a pick list or use the magnifying glass to see all individual tags within that category. Once selected, I can also choose additional available tags. So of those candidates with an A ranking, show me those that also have a hot designation. Now I can change this as an any or all or none relationship. All meaning they must have both, any one or the other, and none, they must have neither of those tags on their record. From here, we also want to see contacts with a particular activity type. So maybe I'm looking for recent contacts who I have created a note, an interview, task, or phone screen. And because this is more pertinent, I need to see just those individuals that have this activity logged since September 1st. From here, whether it's down below or up above, I can start to add additional fields if I'd like. Maybe I'd like to filter down by primary owner to see all of those contacts owned by Ian Remington. Also, I'd like to add an additional filter to see when these records were created. Because not only do I want them to have new activity, but I'd also like to see records that have been created will go back to January 1st of this year or on. Once I've finally defined this specific filter, I can save it using the save option above prior to naming this query. I can also choose to share this with other users in my database and then select OK. Now this specific query will live within the contact section of your Crelate database. To access it, I can change my view by selecting the drop down menu in the top left hand corner. This will give me a listing of the default views your saved queries, and lists up above. You'll see I can also choose to favorite, so as my queries and lists do build, I can not only favorite them, and the icon here will show me that this is a shared query with everyone in my organization. And that will conclude this video, so thanks for watching.